Hi, I'm John. I'm a maths teacher currently teaching in Brixton. Today, I'm going to help you go through some maths problems, such as this, and I hope that it helps. Let's say you want to multiply two fractions together, like three sevenths and two elevenths. At first, this looks quite complicated, but actually multiplying fractions is really easy. All you have to remember is that you multiply the numerator and the denominator separately. Let's start with the numerator. 3 multiplied by 2 is 6, and that is our new numerator. 7 multiplied by 11 is 77, and this is our new denominator. It really is as simple as that. Let's try another example. Let's try 8 over 12 multiplied by 3 over 5. Once again, multiply the numerators together. It gives us 24. That's what 8 times 3 gives us. Then we find our denominator. 12 times 5 is 60. And we're given our answer. However, there is another step here. If we remember, whenever we're given a fractional answer, it's always best practice to simplify this. 24 and 60 both have a common factor of 6, and this means that 24 divided by 60 can simplify to 4 over 10. 4 and 10 have a common factor of 2, which means we have 2 fifths. So the simplest answer to 8 divided by 12 multiplied by 3 divided by 5 is 2 fifths. And this is how to multiply fractions together.